Right now we're just going to over, go over a basic um, defensive stance and then we're going to move on from there and um, kind of speed it up a little bit and show you some a little bit more advanced techniques. Right now you always remember your defensive stance should always be a nice strong core. What I mean by that, my feet, I'm always ready. I'm on my toes, I'm on the balls of my, off the balls of my feet. My stick's always off and ready off my body just so I have a, a check if I have to check. And I'm always nice and strong. My, my back is nice and straight. My, stu my stomach's nice and tight. I'm ready right here on my balls of my feet. You can even tap your feet if you want to so you know that your feet are always ready to go. This really intimidates the offensive player. If you're right here tapping ready to go, your sticks are off your body, they really don't know what to expect from you. From here, you kind of want to move on after you get that strong defensive stance and you're in there. You're always nice and low. Remember, you cannot check from up top and you cannot uh, defend someone from up top. You really want to be nice and sh strong in your stance. So I'm down here. Next thing I want to do is take something away. You don't have to open. The first thing you don't want to do is open up your hips. What I mean by that, the, the middle of the field is the most important part of the field. You never want to open your hips. You don't want to do this. This is really bad. What you want to do is basically stay nice and low and do the staircase motion. So what is that? That all is, is I'm going to drop step back and just take something away. The same thing the other way, drop step back, take something away. I'm never opening up my hips.